A theater group at Texas Woman's University in Denton is out to make sure that their art is still seen and heard even in the middle of the pandemic. Our Ken Molestina today introduces us to the Car Park Sonnets. That fire which many legions of true hearts had worn. These days, the stage, theater seats, and the curtains have all been traded in for a parking lot with front row views through a windshield and an FM dial a great while ago, the world begun with a to round out the experience. Folks, welcome to Shakespearean theater in the COVID era. Welcome to Car Park Sonnets at Texas Woman's University. It is a collection of sonnets and monologues all woven together with original bits and pieces. Originality seems to be key here for Hannah Fuller and the rest of the cast because figuring out how to make this performance happy was not easy. We deal with rain, wind, um, train sounds, planes. Um, so it's a very different format of putting on a show. The students really raised their game and it was it was inspirational to see them find a way to um, keep doing what it is they love doing. Tracy Jordan drove 40 miles from Duncanville to see the show. This is a great innovative way to uh, do something new and unusual with uh, with with Shakespeare. And for parents like Brian and Delight Hogan, missing their daughter's performance was not an option, even if it was unlike any other play they've seen before. But this was just extra special and just such a, a neat feeling during this time when we've been so closed in to be out here experiencing this. Leave it to theater kids to be really creative and come up with something really great. And when the audience is pleased, we got a couple little honks and some flashing lights. <laughs> The actors are reminded of one important rule. As Shakespeare says, all the world's a stage. And that includes a concrete lot. All right, folks, so if you want to get out to one of these shows, you are in luck. They have shows scheduled for tonight, Saturday night and Sunday night. Have fun and enjoy your weekend. I'm Ken Molestina, CBS 11 News.